Hey friends, this is Andy Vegan. I make a cacao today with peanuts and here I have these wild peanuts. And you definitely have to try them if you don't know them yet. They have these little speckles here on top of the skin. I don't need to peel them, they're from the jungle, harvested, wild, and organic of course. And they're delicious. And they don't have, have uh, many of these are uh, problems with the regular peanuts. The mold on the peanuts, you're not really sure if you buy regular peanuts if they are not molded. It's very, very subtle, you don't see it. So these peanuts, these wild organic ones, don't have any of these, and they're very healthy, of course. Low in fat, as opposed to nuts, you know, higher in fat. Peanuts are kind of legumes, like a pea, peanut. And it is, you can use it as a nut, but it is low in fat and high in protein. So many, many, uh, many good health benefits for, uh, with a peanut. So I always use the wild, if I, the wild one that I can. And today I make a peanut milk first, and maybe together with a cacao. You could say that I have dates here to make it sweet. Uh, five dates, maybe one and a half cup of peanuts. The dates are small and pitted and, and, and soft. And I have two tablespoons of cacao powder. Yeah, I like cacao powder once in a while. I mean, I don't use it too much, but once in a while I like it a lot. It's raw and organic in this case, and you can take any kind of cacao, cacao powder you like. It's the same with the peanuts. Get the regular cacao powder. There's always also uh, the danger of mold being in there and these kind of things in the cacao. Depends on what kind of uh, blend you have. Get the uh, quality, high quality. Uh, organic is good, and from, of course, best is, uh, especially with cacao beans, you get the... Um, the, the fair trade things um, you have higher standards and you make sure um, they are not um, somehow um, with the bad ingredients in there, bad additionals that's not needed, not good for our health. But if you have a good quality, nothing is wrong. It's a little bit of, of course, uh, stimulating, but then it's nice. It's nice actually. I have a, one liter of water here for this quantity. I will try it. I never made this kind of beverage before with peanuts, cacao and dates. Let's see what happens. Uh, I will know it in a second. After the blender dance. <laughs> or in soups or in beverages you can eat them just as is and so many options today I'm gonna make a cacao and I will filter the cacao for nut milk bag here a large one um, because I want to make a, a day of juice fasting and um, today I'm gonna juice fast my my weekly day of juice fasting gentle juice fasting a special kind of fasting so you don't harm yourself, you don't push yourself, you don't put any pressure on yourself, you just feel delighted. Yeah, delightful. And whatever it takes to feel delighted, you can do it. It doesn't matter. The main thing is to lower the calories and do it on a regular base. So I do it every week, once, once a week. And that is really amazing. You can do it for years and years. You don't need to see any doctor for that because just drinking juices, fresh juices once a day, and there's no health problem connected with that irregular, usually, um, for a regular per, normal person. So I put now, I put the, um, the, the milk, the nut milk with the cacao and the dates blended in the water into the... <laughs> for the nut milk there, in order to get the fiber, uh, the fiber out of the milk. Then it is a finer, more subtle milk and it's like a juice, but the, but, the, but the fiber has been filtered out. The juicing usually reduces the fiber content of the fruit, the juice, as opposed to a smoothie, where you blend everything usually together, uh, including the fiber. Yeah. 
And the fiber is what makes the intestines work. And that is good usually. We need the fiber to be healthy, not only for the intestines, also for the system, the blood. The fiber is in the blood. A lot of more things happen and very good uh, with the fat. Yeah? It gets better digested with the fiber in the blood and so many other things. The sugar gets better digested. So it's really very important to have fiber on a regular basis. So once a, once a week, reducing the fibers, just having the pure nutrients, is very healthy also because you get a day off. Yeah? The working system in the intestines, having a day off and they like that. Yeah? It's, it's very nice to do that. Uh, if, it's, if it's fun, you know, if it's, it's pleasant, if it's delightful, then it's good. If you put stress on yourself, you force yourself, then it's not good because then the system is blocked again and all the beneficial effects are, are minimized or even deleted. So that's why with the gentle juice fasting or the tree yoga moon fasting, because it is always delightful, it's in the flow, and super healthy. Yeah, so that's why I get the fiber out of here. And you see, it takes a little bit longer than uh, regularly because putting the cacao and the peanuts <coughs> and the dates into the nut milk bag after blending it, that makes the little pores in the nut milk bag a little bit um, stuck. So it, it takes a little bit more time and strength to get the juice out of the nut milk bag. The strain here. But it doesn't really matter. You be careful and you still want to wash your nut milk back afterwards to get it clean again. But it just takes some more time. Yeah, a little bit more. But you have a wonderful effect filtering out the nice things, uh, the fiber. And so uh, from the milk makes it a very subtle drink. It's very light and you can enjoy the whole benefits of the nutrients without the fibers. Just to give you a better energy boost. Um, including the day off or the intestine that will the body. The nutrients go directly into the system and make you feel wonderful. <laughs> so, I'm almost done here, a little more. So you have to press a little, squeeze it. And I guess you should do it. What remains in the bag is um, the fiber. It's a kind of meal, a flour, that can be used in cakes and cookies or in soups too, when you make a raw food bread, for example, you can use that too, because there is almost no flavor remaining in the in the meal, in the flour, the nut flour or the, the peanut flour. Um, all the, 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 the flavor is in the nutrients. And it's very delicious. The cacao is very delicious. I mean, I don't know what this uh, peanut cacao would taste like, taste like. I will know that in a moment. But I still can use the, the flour here for the same purposes as like a regular flour meal. There's not so much flavor and it's more the fiber that makes the volume to the cake and makes the cake lighter because uh, you don't want to have the, such a, a firm and heavy cakes and breads. You want to have it lighter usually and that's what this kind of flour is good for. So I put it aside for a while. I will take care of it later. And now I will taste that. First, quickly wash my hands to make it easier, and I'm going to taste it. Very excited now, and then when they taste before, for every day new recipe that includes this one. Let's see. Mm. Oh, very nice. Yeah, it tastes so different. Very really different than a the regular cacao, because um, the peanuts have this this very own flavor on their own, and I like it a lot. Together with the cacao, it's very nicely fitting. It's not too sweet. I didn't use a lot of um, didn't use a lot of sugar. That's five dates, small dates, and one liter of water, and um, two tablespoons of cacao powder, and one and a half cup of peanuts maybe. So this is what it looks like. And I pour it in the glass for you to see, see to watch it. It's very light, you can see how light it is. And that's how it flat tastes out, so very light. And I'm looking forward to you to drink it, to enjoy it. It's full of nutrients, protein, little fat only. And yeah, it makes me feel happy, I guess. <laughs> enjoy, yeah. Tell me how you feel about it, I would be glad to hear it. 
and answer. You can chat on YouTube, my YouTube channel, and be vegan. You can subscribe there. I get a yeah, new recipe every single day. And you push the bell button beside the subscription button after having subscribed, you get notified. Every single day when a new recipe comes out, you get an email, my video is there. <laughs> and then you never miss one. And um, you can also find me on Facebook, MD Vegan. You can find me on Twitter, on Instagram, on Pinterest, wherever you like. I see you soon.